I was concerned. It was, I mean, it was definitely something to worry about. New from us at nine, more than half of Robertsdale High School students didn't show up for class following yesterday's school threat. Police tell us a call was made at the front office yesterday claiming a gunman was going to shoot up the school. Well, there was no gunman, but that didn't stop hundreds of parents from keeping their kids home today. Fox News, Lacey Beasley is joining us live from Robertsdale High School. And Lacey, just how many students were absent today? Well, Byron, out of roughly 1,200 students, 740 were not at school today, and that's according to the Baldwin County School Systems. Now, I talked to a father and student who debated staying home today. The call came in from a block number, and when the representative spoke with the subject on the phone, a threat was uttered to shoot up the school. Robertsdale High School on a soft lockdown Tuesday for several hours as law enforcement scoured campus for an alleged gunman. Robertsdale PD say an administrator picked up the call around 9 a.m. and they suspect the caller to be a man. Police believe the threat was bogus. The intent of this action was to sow chaos and cause disruption and cause panic and, and fear. There was no evidence found or no persons found who would have carried, you know, who could have carried out this threat. So it, it leads me to believe that that was the objective here. When parents caught word, they were concerned. I thought it was just a rumor at first, and I texted him, and he said it was real. Well, no one was allowed to go to the bathrooms anywhere outside the classroom. It was just locked down. They were still teaching, but just not as loud. Uh, there was a lot of officers going around everywhere. James Brumbelow thought about keeping his son Andrew home along with the other 740 students. We talked about it, um, discussed it, and we were prepared to keep him home. And then he, he actually came out this morning. He likes going to school. So he, he came out this morning and said that there was supposed to be a, a heavy police presence today. So it eased our minds a little bit more. Police were there for over half the day and there was not many people in any of my classes. It was about half of, uh, I think it was like 49% of people were actually there. So about half of all my classes were just gone. Now the FBI is now involved after investigators tell me the call came from out of state. They're working to make an arrest. Reporting live in Robertsdale, Lacey Beasley, Fox 10 News.